Good morning, friends. It's good to see you if you've practiced with me before. If not, welcome to Yoga with Paige. Today we have a really, really gentle practice for the neck and the upper shoulders. So this is perfect to do right away in the morning, kind of gently ease ourselves into wakefulness or right before bed, release some of the tension so we can ease ourselves into sleep. Even randomly throughout the day when you have an extra five minutes to spare. This is just a very gentle TLC loving practice for the upper, the upper, which sometimes gets lost in all of the strength training and flexibility. So we're taking time today to treat ourselves. So we can start in a comfortable seat of your choice. Maybe we have a little cushion underneath the hips to support ourselves, elevate the hips a little bit. You can have a folded blanket, a little pillow underneath if you would like, if that's more comfy. We take a few moments to arrive here on the mat. Connecting to our breath, releasing whatever it is we were just doing before we came here whatever we have to do later. This is our time right now. Maybe taking the hands to the belly, just feeling the breath, feeling it flowing through your body, knowing that we can always return back to it in times of stress or discomfort. can blink the eyes open if they were closed. Take the hands to the knees. You're gonna sit up nice and tall, pretending that there is a string from the pelvis, drawing up through the spine, pulling up through the chest, up through the crown of the head. We're sitting up nice and tall, already stretching out the spine, feeling the lengthening happening. And on the next inhale, we're gonna use the opposition of the knees to pull ourselves forward, rolling the shoulders back, lifting the gaze. Coming into a seated cat-cow, on the exhale, rounding through the back, tucking the chin. Feeling this stretch happening all the way from the base of the neck down the spine. Moving with the breath, inhale, lifting the gaze. And exhale, round. Feeling the beautiful space, the opening in the backs of the shoulders. Deep inhale to come up. And exhale, tucking the chin. One more like this. neutral spine. We're going to inhale the arms above the head. Palms meet. Holding here. On the next inhale, we're going to shrug the shoulders all the way up. Up towards the ears. And down. Depress them down. Push them down the back. Again, inhale, lifting them up. Taking the gaze up. Finding this length. You can feel it in the side body. And exhale, shrugging them down. One more time, big inhale. And exhale, releasing the hands, sending them out to the sides, nice and long. So we're gonna turn to the side, but only moving from the upper cavity. So we're not trying to twist down here. We're trying to make these as slow as we can. So we really feel the twist the upper shoulders, we're squeezing the shoulder blades together, moving nice and slow. You can feel this in the upper back, a little bit of strengthening happening in the shoulders. They're definitely being woken up now. One more time, each side, even it out. And inhaling the arms back up above the head. Big stretch, reach, reach, reach. And then exhale, taking the hands behind the head. We're gonna interlace the fingers, 
and make a little pillow for our necks here. <sighs> Taking one breath here. I'm losing my train of thought. Taking one breath here. We're not going to go too far, but we're just going to lift the gaze up, kind of making that little pillow here, letting our head rest on our hand. Our spine is still nice and tall. We're holding here. And on your next exhale, we're going to draw the elbows together, tuck the chin into the chest, only rounding at the top of the spine. So we're not going into a ball like that. We're only bringing the elbows in and then tucking the chin. So we still should be sitting up nice and tall, really feeling this in the neck, letting the hands assist, assist gravity in helping tuck the chin. Maybe gently, gently rolling the neck side to side, feeling the opening happening in the back of the neck. One breath. And gently lifting back up, keeping the hands behind the head, elbows are out to the sides. We're gonna dip to the right side, feeling a beautiful stretch through the top of the rib cage, going all the way up the arm to the elbow, gazing up. Exhale through center, gazing to the right, dropping the left elbow. And back. One more time, each side, making this nice big stretch, trying to send the elbows back so we're as open as we can be throughout the front body. And this time coming through center, keeping the hands behind the head, we're going to just tilt the elbow, boop, and then the other one. So we're going a little bit faster, not taking our neck our gaze as far, we're kind of opening up through the ribs, the whole front back, we're still squeezing the shoulder blades together. <sighs> Even it out, and then we can release the hands behind the head. Taking fingertips to mat, we're gonna just take gentle, gentle little neck rolls. Moving slowly, feeling the sensations coming up through the spine, feeling the connection points from the neck to the shoulders, to the base of the skull. And then making sure to reverse and go the other way. Breathing nice and deep. Come back up through center. Going to take the hands behind us, take the feet to the mat, and windshield like wiper the legs. So slowly, we're just going to start with the legs. My back just cracked. You can feel this in the lower back, in the hips. Just getting a gentle twist here. And when your knees fall over to the right side this next time, I want you to keep them here so we can move the left leg out a little bit to find our space if that feels better. And then we take the gaze to the left side. So we're kind of on a little twist here, a little twist with our body. You can feel this in the right side of the neck. Maybe we take the ear to the shoulder. Finding any movement here that feels good. We're here for one more breath. And then we can windshield like for the legs a few more times before sending the knees over to the left side. Letting them hang out here on the left side. We take the gaze to the right. Still sitting up. Maybe we come up onto the fingertips. Beautiful. And release back to center. We can cross our legs, coming into easy seat. Bringing the hands in front of the chest, interlacing the fingers, palms face out. We exhale, push forward, rounding through the back, creating beautiful space 
between the shoulders. Can you feel that? I love opening up through the back upper body. It feels so great. Push. On your next inhale, bring the hands above the head. Reach up. Open up through the collarbones. And exhale, release the hands, bringing them behind the back. Interlace the fingers. Pull the hands down, opening up through the chest. Exhale to release, bringing the hands in front of the chest. We're going to do that one more time. Inhale. And exhale, push the palms away from you. Inhale, draw them up above the head. Inhale, all that beautiful love and light. And exhale, bringing the fingertips behind, interlace, pull the hands down, opening up through the chest. <sighs> Open to all the possibilities this day can bring. <sighs> and exhale to release, floating the hands in front of the chest. <sighs> Taking one final breath together, make it nice and slow and deep. Big inhale and exhale. I hope you enjoyed this quick little practice. Thank you for joining me on the mat today. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. Comment your thoughts down below. Hit that subscribe button to never miss more daily videos and to support me as your guide and free accessible classes for everyone everywhere so much fun practicing with you and i look forward to seeing you on the mat again soon namaste